I'm Nadia Vinson, Digital Transformation AI and Innovation Executive Advisor. So today I'm going to bring you five key strategy for optimizing your revenue generation using artificial intelligence. First, the first strategy is having a specific goal. So having revenue, how much revenue that you want to generate, be specific. That's a, that will allow you to be focused, to be driven and achieve that goal. The second one, the second key strategy is to have a 360 degree business strategy. I mean by that, having a business life cycle strategy that cover all the different business area of your business, all the different business unit. Let's say to achieve a specific revenue, you need to know where you start, what are the different stage with the different unit that you need to cover, even the processes that go if within each different um, business unit until you generate that revenue. So you need to know how you're going to do it, have everything on paper or online, have everything written, what, what, is, what are the strategies in order to achieve that revenue goal. And that straight strategy across every business unit because you cannot implement artificial intelligence in one business unit or two business units for it to be effective. No, you need to use it throughout your business, throughout the organization in order to leverage it, in order to have the best um, return on investment on it. And it's all the business that should be aligned on using artificial intelligence, on using data, on using the input and output from one business unit to another business unit. So it's a unit, it's a 360 degree business digital strategy that you need as the second key strategy. The third one, is to use different type of artificial intelligence. You know, we as human, we, we, we have different type of intelligence, our ability to learn, our ability to memorize things and then to repeat it. it it's the same thing for AI. There are different type of artificial intelligence. So for example, machine learning, we allow the machine to learn, we teach the machine to le learn. But the machine will sometimes, I would warn you, and that's the way it goes. And that's what we need for the machine to have to develop some pattern of learning so that it continue learning from the data that you are feeding the data so that you can get the best return on it. So machine learning is a type of artificial intelligence to use on specific uh, for specific needs. Another type of artificial intelligence is RPA, rapid process automation tool that allow you to automate repetitive tasks. And you can make it even more complex depend on the, the logic that you're to, going to create. So rapid process automation to automate your processes in the business. Then there are a variety of artificial intelligence, we'll say cognitive artificial intelligence, or generic artificial intelligence with different skills for calculating, for images and everything. So uh, that's a combination of intelligence that you can use for different things for every day, uh, for researching, for creating. And next is robotic. Robotic is great for anything that required physical forces, physical presence, different material, accessing different places. Robotic is another type of artificial intelligence. So those are some examples of artificial intelligence. And the best use of artificial intelligence is to consider all type of artificial intelligence available and how you can integrate them into the business strategy, the 360 degree business strategy that you've defined earlier. Strategy number four is to use a combination of artificial intelligence and other digital technologies. By other digital technologies, I mean technologies such as blockchain, cloud, well, cloud, it's a must because you need more data for artificial intelligence. Without data, you don't have artificial intelligence. So it's very important to invest in cloud 
technology, but as well in data science. The more you learn about data, the more you learn on how to take advantage of the data, to reuse the data, to question the data, data is, uh, is a very important asset. So you can invest as much as you need in data, even the skills for data. It can be mobility. You, you also combine artificial intelligence with mobility, depending on your sector. There is drone technology. So combining artificial intelligence with different types of digital technology allow you to optimize the capacity for producing revenue with artificial intelligence. The fifth strategy is to use field-specific artificial intelligence and generic artificial intelligence. What I mean by that is, for example, if you are in the financial sector, so you're going to use some uh, artificial intelligence, you're going to use some artificial intelligence solution that are designed and created specifically for the financial industry. But not, not only that, you combine it with generic artificial intelligence so that you can achieve different tasks that you need and you can, you can um, complement the field-specific artificial intelligence. Those are five key strategies for, for optimizing. Those are five key strategies for optimizing revenue generation with artificial intelligence. So I'll do a recap. First, you need to have goal-specific in order to achieve specific revenue goal. Second, you need to have a 300 business transformation strategy for implementing artificial intelligence covering all business units of the business. Three, you need a combination of artificial intelligences. You need a combination of all type or various type of artificial intelligence. Four, you need to combine artificial intelligence with different type of digital technologies. Fifth strategy is to use field-specific artificial intelligence and generic artificial intelligence to work together. So thank you very much. And, and should you need help with your digital transformation strategy or your artificial intelligence strategy, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. Thank you. And you can find more information about us at digitaltransformationleaders.com. Thank you. Thank you.